Hi guys, this is Dale Ross. I'm going to do a quick video review of a kit that I purchased online, which included a what was called a selfie Bluetooth wireless camera remote control shutter and an Ivation universal cell phone tripod mount adapter. First, the packaging, not an unboxing video, very poor packaging. That'll be noted on Amazon. Okay, let's get right to the grip. I did find that uh, the same design grip as, a, as this Ivation. Uh, it was sold separately, approximately five, six bucks. And there were some other manufacturers, or excuse me, some other brands, looked to be the same design. So they could be the same manufacturer. May, they could be a different manufacturer. Cannot tell you that. But they all look to work the same and had the same design. As long as you don't grab a button, you should be okay. Now, I have concern that this spring or these springs will fatigue and then the grip will not be there and the phone can fall out. Uh, I have concern that vibration could uh, potentially move it out over time, especially as this fatigues. And uh, orientations and all could be a concern for you. For the videos that I want to shoot right now, it's probably going to be okay, but I can see this will not be a long-standing device with me, and I will get one of the better multi-grip devices. Okay. Oh, before I go to the Bluetooth, let's show you this on a Lumia 1520. That is a six-inch phone. So that's what I want to show you is that it can connect up to a uh, or hook up to a six inch phone. And then uh, here is a an iPhone 5S, a smaller device that's in an outer box. So there you go. There's your quarter 20 threading so that you can put your camera mount on it. And now let's get to the Bluetooth remote shutter control. Here's the owner's manual, not much to it. The owner's manual, the online description, the box all stated, iOS compatible and Android. Now they did say that, or the owner's manual does say that if you have problems with your Android device, there's an app you can download from the Google Play Store called uh, Camera 360, I think it is, and that should allow the device to work. But Bluetooth, and it did not mention Windows Mobile or Windows Phone, but I figured Bluetooth has got to work. If not, I'll send it back. And there you go. You see I am connected. All I had to do was place the battery in it, push the button to turn it on, Came to the screen, discovered it, paired it, boom, I was there. So let's take a picture. All right, so I didn't have to do that. Just all I got to do is hit the camera button. One of the things I like about this phone is it has a camera button. So here we go, and I've got the flash on so you can see it uh, flash. And there you go. Hopefully you saw this work. You saw that I'm pushing. All right, not much more to say about it other than I don't see this device sticking with me. And if you do a lot of removal, shooting a lot of videos and adding it on and taking it off, I expect that spring is gonna wear on you. Well, thank you and tell me what you think of the video.